my channel and if you are new my name is Melissa and welcome to my channel. Today we have an exciting shop Disney haul so let's get started. Yes today I'm going to show you guys what I ordered from shop Disney. A new collection came out. You might be able to guess like what sort of theming um I picked out for myself. Um, but yes, a new collection came out and I was so excited. I bought a couple pieces from it. Um, I bought a pair of ears and I also bought a bag, spoiler alert. <laughs> um, but let's go ahead and get into it because I'm so excited. All right, I got my baby scissors. <laughs> These are the only scissors in my house right now for whatever weird reason. I don't know where the scissors run off to, but it's not in my house because I can never find them. So... <laughs> We're gonna use these scissors that are not very sharp and I think are about 10 years old. <laughs> uh, all right, hold on, let me do this off camera. All right, let's start with the ears. There's a little sneak peek of the ears. Like I said, oh my gosh, this was a Disney Parks exclusive and then also Shop Disney. I believe it's still available. The bag might not be available, but I'm pretty sure the ears are still available. Um, oh my gosh, there's so many tags. Hold on. Ooh, let me flip them around. Okay. Here are the ears. Let me see if you can get these. And these do light up um, somehow. Let me see. I think it's... <gasps> oh my gosh. That is so adorable. I'm obsessed with that. Look at that. That's such a bright glow. Okay, okay. I'm getting ahead of myself. <laughs> I'm just really excited. Okay. So on this ear, we have a bunch of fireworks. We have a few Mickey fireworks and a few other ones. And if you can see, there's little colored light bulbs in a bunch of the fireworks. And that's the part that lights up. And then on the same side, we have pretty much the same pattern, but like reversed, it looks like. Um, and then in the middle, we have the, oh my gosh, I'm doing, I'm also, a <laughs> side note, if... I look like I'm struggling is because I'm using a new way of filming. I'm filming from my back camera versus my front camera to try and get like better quality close-ups. <laughs> so I apologize if it's a little bit of a struggle. But um, in the middle we have the partner statue and this beautiful like silvery sparkly bow. Like look at the texture of this bow close up. Oh, I love it. Um, and like I said we have a bunch of tags. This tells us all about how to use it and of course the shop Disney tags. And then this right here let me open it up or get it off this thing hold on I need scissors for this um there actually is a charger that goes with it because these are not battery operated they are charging operated which I absolutely love as a side note um I think that it's really cool because I I never have batteries personally and also like for especially for the uh lounge fly bags I never know like which batteries to use because the, the like switches are so small and I, I I don't know batteries very well so yes there is a charger me here we go um and it's just a USB charger or is it a USB-C I think is what it is I can't tell um I have a million of these chargers but cool thing is it came in a little velvet bag which I think is cute so yes I'm officially keeping these I was gonna keep them either way um but let me get go back to the ears so yes, these are the ears. These came out, again, for the Disney 100th, and I forget what this collection was called, will it say, on the, here, let me look at the Walt Disney Mickey Mouse Partner Collection. That's what my <laughs> packing slip says, at least. Um, so yes, um, these are so cute. I, I'm all over the place. Also, y'all, I have not filmed in a hot minute. I batch film my videos, so usually... When you guys see videos, they're videos that I filmed like in one day <laughs> that I post over the course of a month. So um, I just, I always like trying to get back into the swing of it, but by the third video, I'm usually good. <laughs> At least I hope so. But like, look how shiny and sparkly the like middle one is. It's like an enamel pin almost in the middle. Let me show you guys the back because the back is also really cool. It's like a faux leather, but what's cool about the back there's the charging port and then there is the switch right here to flip it on let me see the switch um and then there's also of course there's no long receipt cvs receipt tag which is nice because those are always so annoying and i never know how to cut them off but um 
there is the Disney 100th logo. And I, is this my first Disney 100 piece of merch? I think it is. No, I have one other pair of ears, but I don't have a bag. Or until now, I didn't have a bag. But yeah, these are so cool. Let me like cut off the tags because I'm keeping these no matter what. Um, you can kind of see, let me show you the like explainer. That's the explaining of the uh, <laughs> thing. But here we go. Here's them without the tags. And let me show you how they light up again. Want to get, once again. Look how cool that is. I was not expecting the bow to light up. But I love it. I think it's so powerful too. Like sometimes with light up things, especially with lounge flies, they don't light up super well. But this one lights up so well. And I love it. I love it. It's so beautiful. I'm so excited about these ears. And I don't have a pair of fireworks ears so far. So very exciting. All right, let's move into the lounge fly. Oh, before I move into the lounge fly, I do want to say these are Disney Parks brands, not Disney Loungefly brands, just in case you are thinking of buying them and you wanted to know if you only collect Loungefly ears or vice versa. So wanted to throw that out there. Okay, yeah, so now we have the bag. It's the same collection. If you've already seen it, you already know, but I will try and show you more details. Here it is in all of its glory. Let me unwrap it so you guys don't have to listen to the crinkly noise. All right, here it is. Let's take a look at it. I'm gonna show you guys first. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm so excited, I'm so excited. They started also putting these things in with the bags, which I don't get, but whatever. Um, has that new lounge fly smell? Oh my gosh, it's been so long since I've opened like a brand new lounge fly that wasn't resale. Oh my gosh, that's a thick tag. Look at these tags. Oh my gosh, that's so many tags. Oh my gosh, let me just take a minute. <laughs> Oh, it's so pretty. I love it. I am not a Walt Disney collector, like, whatsoever. I don't think I even have, like, a single Walt Disney merch, but I love the partner statue. I don't know if it exists, but I would love, like, a little ceramic version of it. If it does exist, let me know. Um, but I love the partner statue, and I think it's so iconic, too. Um, I'm also not a huge fireworks person. I love it on merch. I just, I'm not a huge, like, um, like stand and watch it because I, I get a little crowd anxiety especially at Disneyland with the way that they have the fireworks set up anyway I digress um but I do love watching it from afar but not in the parks if that makes sense oh my gosh the details on this too I think this is the best depiction of fireworks I've seen so far all right let me show you guys enough of me staring at it look at it let me just do like a little pan up and down so I'll do like a little 360 if you will all right so here's the front as you can see there is light up parts of it and you know what's crazy to me is like how do they get it flush like it's completely flat do you see that like no bumps I don't understand it <laughs> um and also I will also say if you you're scared of taking a left uh light up bag into the parks because it rains um I've taken light up bags into the park and it's rained on them and they've been completely fine. So don't worry, but I just wouldn't suggest turning them on, but you can get them wet. <laughs> um, anyway, so here is the bag right here. Let me show you the sides. Look at those fireworks. Aren't they so pretty? Like, I feel like they just look so, oh, well, not realistic, but like realistic animation if that makes sense and here's the other side this one's my favorite I love this firework I think it just looks so cool and there is side pockets which I love I love the side pockets of course there's this huge front pocket which I also love um let's take a look at what the interior lining is oh my gosh it's so darling I love it hold on let me like take the foam piece out so you guys can see it better um the design does not continue into the pocket it's just black but Look at that lining. Isn't that so cool? I absolutely love that. That's so cool. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. And then the back of the bag. Lift these up and out of the way. Um, there is like stars. Let me see. On the like straps, which is just so cool. I love it. And then it says Disney 100... 100 years of wonder 
Wow, I love that. So let me do, I, this is totally copying Hannah Enchanted. If you don't watch her, I highly recommend. She does a 360, so let me give you guys a little 360 of the bag as a whole. Yeah, like look at that. So darling. And then also it is silver hardware, in case you were curious. Okay, let me scoot back into the frame. Um, I wanted to give the backpack its own moment, if you know what I mean. <laughs> All right, um, let me take this out and see if it lights up or if I need to charge it. Let's see. Okay, no, this is like a full battery pack with like normal batteries. Interesting, okay. All right, I did have to take a full tab out, but let me see if I can show you guys. Like, it's a pretty hefty battery pack. Um, let me turn it on. Oh my gosh! And they're different colors. Look at that. My lights are really bright. I know you probably won't be able to see it. But look how cute, cool that is. I love that. I love light up bags. I think it's just such an innovative thing to exist. Let me see. It probably won't have an interior pocket because they never do. But let me just double check. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm ripping things. Not the bag, just the packing paper. Yeah, no interior pocket, but that's okay. This is what the inside looks like. It's a very stiff bag, I will say. So if you're curious about that at all, it's a very, very stiff bag. But yeah, look, look at these two together. Look at them together. Let me give you a little 360 of the ears as well. I don't know, 360 more like a 180. <laughs> But yeah, I love this collection. Um, and like I said, there haven't been, I haven't been a huge fan of the Disney Decades collection as a side note. I'm a little off to the side. Let me, let me scoot. <laughs> a lot of moving parts. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, I haven't been a huge fan of the Disney Decades collection. I really do actually like the Louis bag that came out um, for the 2000s. But I ha already have a Louis bag, so I'm still debating on getting it. But I do really, really like it. Um, but, uh, yeah, I just, ha there's, I like the three Cabaneros ears that came out with one of the lines, but I just haven't really loved the backpacks very much, um, which is fine. Um, but there is another Disney 100 bag that's coming out. It's the purple one with all the Fab Five characters and the castle. I really, really, really want that one in particular because, like, it looks absolutely stunning. Um, and it's purple, which is my favorite color it's my favorite shade of purple um so I think I'm just gonna get the bag for that one I'm not gonna get the ears because I am iffy on the ears um but the back looks absolutely stunning it's already come out in the UK and Shop Disney Asia I think um but it has not come out in the US yet which is really sad because I want it to come out it had the ears have landed and I think Disneyland and possibly Disney World but the bag has yet to come but yeah I'm so excited about these but the question is how do I how do I store this do I store it with do I tie it onto the bag onto the ears <laughs> I don't know but yes let me know down below did you enjoy this unboxing did you get either the ears or the bag for yourself um are you going to get if you don't have it yet are you going to get the bag or the ears I absolutely love them. They're so darn. And, oh, I didn't put them on. Let me put them on so you guys can see them on. There you go. They're a little out of frame. Let me, let me press the button too. There you go. Here are them on. I, well, let me get a little back, back and down. There we go. So you guys can see them. But yes, so let me know down below if you enjoyed the unboxing and if you got these bags or if you got any Disney 100 items for yourself. And if any of them were particularly exciting, if you went to the parks during the Disney 100, because I believe it's now over, I think it ended October 16th or something like that. Um, yeah, let me know down below. Um, I absolutely love these. I, should I display the ears and the, the bag together? I don't know. I just, so many thoughts. I just love it so much. But thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed the video, give me a like down below and subscribe for more magic from me. And I will see y'all next time. Bye!